G'day ladies and gents and welcome back need? to Kingdom Come Deliverance with Mags and today we're getting right into it. So Radzik sent me with an important message. He asked for reinforcements. He needs more men? What's going on? The bandits and humans have set up camp in Pribislavitz. They're preparing for something. So Radzig wants to mount an assault on them, but he doesn't have enough men. Hang on. Easy now. From the beginning. What happened? I managed to track down the camp of the bandits who raided Neuhof. But it's not just a gang of brigands. More like a small army in a fortified encampment. I don't know what they're up to, but I'm sure they're getting ready for something. And Sir Radzig wants to destroy them before they get a chance. So it's worse than I thought. But Sir Radzig is right. We should do something about them before it's too late. I'll send my soldiers. Sir Radzig said to take all your men and leave only a minimum guard at the castle. What? Everyone? There really are a lot of them, Sir Divish. He's leaving the camp almost empty, too. We're to go and join his people in Pribislavitz and mount an assault together. All right, then. Sir Radzig knows what he's doing. I'll muster the men and send them with Captain Robard in command. Would you leave my men there right now? Now, it didn't occur to me when I said yes to this option yes, that I wouldn't have access to my horse once this particular quest started. My horse is where all of my spare arrows are. I've only got about 15 on my character at the moment. Anyways, as I'm sure most of you have worked out, this mission is the attack on the bandit cumin encampment. So, I hope you enjoy. It looks like we've got some wonderful weather for the assault. I'm glad to see you, Captain Robard. I hope Henry's explained everything to you. He did. But I find it hard to believe. Who could possibly put together such a significant military force and right under our noses? We'll you had a castle out. burned so down by an army you didn't know was battle. coming until they had already set a now, siege. Who knows what they'll be capable of in a week or two? I agree entirely, my lord. What's the plan? You're an idiot. Right, lad. We're almost at the place you described. Now we'll have to advance cautiously. I need you to tell me how it looks around the camp so I can decide which side to lead the attack from. Sir, that's a big responsibility. I don't think I should... I asked I've grown some balls, boy. Henry. Come You've on. been there and seen everything, so speak up. There are three ways to get in. Directly along the straight path to the camp, the long way round through the woods and over an old weir, or by a narrow bridge over a deep ditch. Let's start with the direct route. That sounds like the easiest approach. How does it look there? That path leads round their battlements. It's fortified and patrolled. The chances are they'd shower us with arrows on the way. I never here, saw Henry. that when I scouted Have the camp out, so way. how does Henry know about it? What about the approach through the woods and the weir? I, I really am like a the bad idea scout. Of marching such a long way over rough ground, but if it's the better option. It's a long way through the woods, and there are patrols there as well. They'll call the alarm before we reach the camp. I thought so. What about the last approach over the bridge? It's a bit narrow for my liking. It's the narrow, bridge I saw. But once we get over, we can quickly occupy the best ground for a battle. We only have to take down a few archers. The battleground sounds inviting, but that bridge in the archers, it's not an easy decision. Each option has its pros and cons. I try to answer to the best of my ability, sir. And you'll be suitably rewarded for your efforts. From what you I say, better the be. I've got a whole lot of side options. quests I want to do. If we're fast, we'll have the advantage. With the help of God, we'll win this day. Alright, so, looks like we're going to go for the bridge, which is the path that I actually came directly into when I found the camp. We'll approach from the south and storm them over the bridge. Form up. Forward march. Got a few guys here. Yeah, at some point I'm going to have to convince Henry to actually clean the blood off the sword. I haven't even started killing people yet, and it's already filthy. To the bridge, quickly! Get to the other side as many as you oh. All right, we've got archers, one, two, and three. Mm. Shit. Quit. Oh, good reaction. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on. Fight me. Uh, 
Oh, there we go. It's one. Yep, he is definitely dead. Shit, stupid. Push. Ow. Well, I think he actually hit my shield then, so that's not so bad. Jesus Christ, guys, it's one archer. There. Just slow. Get your shit in order. Let's go. Come on. I had a hammer at this point. I really should have tried to invest in one, but I did, didn't have time considering this is all chained. But, ow! You dirty bastard! Alright, okay. right, so this is another pet hate of mine with the group combat in Kingdom Come Deliverance. It's this. This soft lock-on. You've got to hit shift to basically sprint to get it to disengage, and the second you're not sprinting, it automatically soft locks onto whoever you grab. It just, you can't... Come on, die. Thank you. You, you can't look around in combat without it sort of snagging somebody. You have no ability to free look. There needs to be a free look option so you can see what's going on. Hello? I can't seem to lock or hit those. Odd. Actually, what might work might be um, uh, armor threes. Got to you know, you hold alt and you can look around independent of where you're actually aiming your gun. A system like that might actually work to solve that problem with combat. And that's what we're loading. All right, so we've got a cut scene, and that. Looks like the main, possibly the main gate into the compound. I didn't see that when I was scouting, so I'm not sure. Oh, okay. There's a few of those. Ah, uh, no. This is just the. This is the Cuban camp. This is the camp that I was in. Not another stack. Oh. Oh. <laughs> As soon as this quest is done, I'm getting a hammer. I need a hammer. Actually, I wonder if I can poison a hammer. That. Hello there, boys. Jesus Christ. Oh, and that was obviously the commander. Commander, let's see if there's anything interesting on him. And oops, take your arrow. Uh, nothing worth spending too much time looting. Ooh. There you are. Muster up! Deal with those archers before we're all shot! Alright, Mercy Kill won't activate, but it looks like they want me to deal with archers now. So, it's a good thing I was grabbing arrows, because I'm going to need a few more than I actually have. Um, none stored in the... No. There are no boxes or containers in the tents, but... Looks like they've got a couple on them. On each of the corpses. At least. Up. At at oh, somebody just drilled that corpse. That's alright. 
I'll take that. Right, now where are these archers? It'll be at the top of that wall, I reckon. Mission failed. Okay, looks like I'm supposed to get up there and kill them before the main force arrives. We can take him down now. And he looks like he dropped him. Miss. Right. There we go, that one got him, straight into the ribs. You're too small a target. Looks like I've missed most of the melee here. Yeah. <laughs> There's something about that move, just blocking them aside and then driving the tip of the sword into their face and watching them drop is just... Here appears to be in full plate. Uh, ooh! Alright, I'll have that. Um, if I take anything else, I'm going to be overweight. So I might see if I can loot these after the fight is over. It's giving. Just in case I can't, I now have myself a new plate chest piece that I can put on. What the hell? It's the approach! Defend this fucking hell! All right, here we go again. The thing here is I don't have to aim, and I'm out of arrows, and they're already here. Shit, should have changed over to the extra arrows that I picked up. That's one. Come on, have a go. There we go. And again. Shit. You counted me then. Cheeky bastard. A lot of these seem to be going. of these attacks seem to be going a little bit odd. Stay down there. 
as an awful lot of background noise at the moment, considering how few are left alive. Seems to be all of them. And it looks like we have another cutscene. cocky and confident this time, is he? Where are you running to, you lanky mongrel? <laughs> I will cleave you into two, you bastard. I tried before, and yet here I am. Well, who the hell are you? You don't remember me. You don't remember me? I remember you, though. Well, where's my fucking sword? What the fuck are you on about? What's... Hang on. You're the... Fuck me. I thought we left you to the crows. Tough little fucker, eh? What did you do with my sword? Judging by our last encounter, I'd say you made a big mistake. Where's my fucking sword? But then again, come on. You can say a little bit more than that, Henry. I hope so. Because last time was too easy. Yeah, last time you were running hacks, this time I'm gonna fuck you up. I know where you are. Don't you worry about that. How's the chin? God! You fucking dog! Stop it! You should be bleeding after that. I've poked you in the face with a tip and you're not wearing a helmet. Status activated. Yep, that seems appropriate for this particular fight. Come on. There we go. Watching you bleed is kind of satisfying. Come on. This is supposed to be my moment to finally take him out, and you're gonna take. Alright, take it back. This is kind of satisfying. Gosh. With the hilt. Come on, finish him rightly. Oh, pummel to the forehead. Peasant brat. This is not over yet, you scum. Now where is my sword? What have you done with it? Talk, you bastard. I'll see. Um, um, tell me, do you hear me? 
me? Tell me what you've done with it! <clears throat> I'd say you're flogging a dead horse there. <laughs> Slightly <laughs> overkill, Henry. Just, just a little. Well done. Nice work. You but you know what? I'm not complaining. A mountain of a man. He was the one who attacked Noyov. And stole your sword, sir. The thought did cross my mind. What did he tell you? If we'd taken him alive, the executioner might have gotten more out of him. Oh well, these things happen in the heat of battle. Anyway, we found a trunk full of coin down below. Someone was paying this gang very well. You know, some of Sigismund's barbarians among them. I don't think we've seen the last of this. Whoever engineered it is highly not. placed. They won't give up after one defeat. This louse was just a pawn. I'm afraid you're right, sir. Well, lad. We live to fight another day, eh? That's the fear leaving you, lad. Let it go. Now, put it all behind you. A decent Christian shouldn't dwell on such horrors. I bet you differ, sir. I never want to forget this. The time has come for those whore sons to pay for what they did to us. You're right, my boy. But first, we all need some rest. Yeah, it's we'll probably not a bad idea. We'll meet later in and then decide what to do next. Come what may, you did a good job today. Well, I'm looking at my top, I'm going to need to drop by a, somebody to fix all my gear. you pay for this it's time for the next part of our plan give the word yes sir all right ladies and gents i'm gonna call this until next monday so until then take care